Hi, I'm Dr. Brett Solomon. I'm a general surgeon here at Baylor Centwick's Medical Group. So colon resection, if a patient's coming to me at least with, with something wrong with their colon, there's, there's several reasons why someone would undergo resection of their colon. Um, two most common would be diverticulitis, which is inflammation of the colon, uh, and colon cancer, uh, which is very, very common. Uh, nowadays, we find colon cancer a lot earlier than we used to because of colonoscopy, and so it's curative, and we can do surgery that, that totally cures a patient. It used to be that we would do all these big open operations from stem to stern and, 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 and kind of cut someone all the way open. Recovery was very long. Uh, then we moved to laparoscopic, which I do do a lot of, uh, which is small incisions. Uh, patient, I, I'm at the bedside. Uh, and now I've moved to doing a lot of robotic surgery, which is the, the, the visualization of using the robot, the ability to take out a piece of colon, and when you put the two ends of colon back together, uh, you sew it back together. And so it's just a very meticulous procedure rather than um, staples or, or, or some of the traditional stuff that we do. So recovery is a lot faster. Uh, people usually go home post up day two or three rather than day five to six. Um, and so it's just kind of revolutionized uh, colon surgery in general.